So I'm going to start off with the Freedom Pro Studio Fixing Spray. I'm going to spray it all over my face. My sister is here, by the way. So I went on holiday. Hopefully you can see, but I'm darker. I love it. Now I'm going to go in with my LA Girl Pro Conceal Orange Corrector, as always. Kind of look, you know, normalish. Gonna get it on my pigmentation. So I just corrected a little bit under my eyes and stuff. So now I'm gonna go in with the Maybelline Color Tattoo On and On Bronze. I'm gonna take a synthetic brush, like a fluffy brush. Just gonna pull it all over my eye. Like so. Just all the way up to the crease. No, you don't have to be like overly neat with this. It's all good, it's all good. Okay guys, here we are. This is my actual color. There was a little bit of a, you know, glitch. <laughs> so Beyonce had quite a smoky, crimson berry, cranberry, bronze eye. So that's why I put the bronze base. And now I'm just taking a black, it's just, I don't even know. The name rubbed off. I think it's MUA. Just a black coal pencil. I'm just gonna go roughly on the eyeliner thing. What's this called? Eyelid? Lash line. Lash line. Thank you. This, ladies and gentlemen, is why I have my sister around. I'm gonna take a fluffy brush. Just blend it. Just smoke it all out. You don't have to be neat about it. And just build up as you need. This thing is really creamy. Sorry about my watery eyes, guys. For some reason, every time I record, I get sick. I just start sneezing and sniffing. My sister is coughing her life away. She's at uni, by the way. She just comes to visit now. We're not special anymore. She only comes because she has to work. Yeah, just go back and forth, smudge it out. I'll smudge it a little bit more in the outer corner and, you know, just smudge it up. Ugh, words. I'm gonna leave it like this for now and then I'm gonna start putting the eyeshadow on. Okay, so. For the eyeshadow, I'm going to use the It's Judy Time palette. As you can see, I love it very much. And I found that I think these are like really warm bronzy shades. So I'm going to go with these two and this crimson sparkly thing on top. But I haven't tested this out yet. So let's see how it goes. I'm just going to take a eyeshadow brush. And um, this brown here is actually quite red tone. So I'm going to go with that first. Let's see how it goes. Okay. Okay. I think I like this. I'm gonna take a clean, fluffy brush. This is the MAC 224. It's gonna blend it upwards. Let's build it up, guys. Same shade, a little bit more. I'm starting off over that black um, line I just smudged out. And just the remainder of a bit higher. And then blend with a clean brush. So I'm gonna put the same on the other eye. So my cousins are coming today because they need a haircut. Yes, I cut hair too. So proud of myself. I also cut my sister's hair. She doesn't let anybody else cut her hair. can say yes out loud so people believe me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So this is quite red, which is what I wanted. It's like a reddish brown. So just keep blending and on the picture, Beyonce had it like all the way up. I'm all the way up. So Beyonce had it all the way up to her crease. I'm gonna put this sparkly shade on top. I'm gonna use the same brush, by the way. And then blend it. Okay, I just realized that there's not enough glitter on this eyeshadow, but we're just gonna pretend like there is. Just blend it, blend, blend, blend. So uh, again, I'm just putting it over the line and then slowly blending it up. And then I use my fluffy brush to blend all the way up. Like Sir John is doing really, really well with the looks. Like he kept it pretty bronzy. There's another one I really liked. He like did it dark on the inner corner and outer corner and then like really bronzy on the inside. Also when we went, oh, by the way, we went to see Beyonce. She had like some amazing makeup on too. We went to see Beyonce in Wembley. Oh my gosh, like, I'm gonna try and put that footage out there, but holy crap, we were just literally screaming every single song. Okay, I need some more red in it, so I'm gonna try, um, probably gonna use a mixture of these two. 
these two. I'm just gonna quickly wet it with that spray I used earlier. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like this. Okay, so I think this shade is much better. It's not too dark. I think I did it a little bit too dark earlier. So, blend. I want Sir John to do a master class on Beyonce's name. I would go. I would spend all my life savings on that. Kind of go over. Blend. Blend. I'm gonna put a little bit under my eyes as well. But it's mainly gonna be smudged out with the black anyway. Now I'm taking that black pencil again and just going over it. Now I'm just going to take my regular eyeliner, which is the Freedom, no sorry, this is the Revolution Makeup, what? Awesome, double, whatever, liner. It's going to start right at the lash line. And then wing it out. Oh my god, my eye is red. <sighs> this might as well be a Halloween tutorial. Y'all know how to do a wing liner, right? Just go watch that girl that does it in one go. Crazy. What's her name? Jalen. Jalen? Go watch her. It's crazy. Just goes zoop, zoop, done. I'm just like, like every time. I'm just a struggle coach. I'm gonna take the same pencil, just go inside the eye. I'm so sorry about this red eye. I don't know what happened. So I'm going all the way inside the in the corner and in the waterline and just kind of smudging it all out. I'm just gonna cover my lashes and put like lots and lots of mascara on. I always do one eye at a time. And I'm using my trusty great lash. Oh, whoa, <laughs> this way. It just looked like she, I'm not sure. I think she probably put like the small lashes, like natural lashes on, and then just like lots of mascara. So it looks kind of natural. Don't forget your bottom lashes because she has lots of mascara on her bottom ones as well. Oh my god, this looks so scary. <laughs> I'm gonna put a second coat on the top lashes as well. I haven't decided whether I'm gonna put lashes on yet. So that's it with the eyes for now. Just gonna go on with the brows. I'm just gonna lightly fill them in. Oh, by the way, this is an, probably an MUA uh, brow pencil as well. I like my MUA. It's cheap and it's very pigmented. Like, everything costs about a pound. It's great. I'm gonna take the spoolie, just brush it up. Because she always brushes her brows up, up and away. But her stick, though. I'm just gonna put a little bit of mascara over the top. Maybe it will make it stay. I'm gonna clean up under the brow a little bit and highlight it at the same time. This is the e.l.f. concealer brush, a uh, concealer <laughs> pencil. And I got it in the sale because I think e.l.f. was refurbishing their website or restocking or new, new, like redesigning their packaging or whatever it was. And like everything was like a pound or 50 pieces. So I was like, hell yeah. So I have this sample of the MAC, the waterproof foundation. That I got a while ago. Hopefully it will match. I guess this is too light. It's fine. We'll work with it. Okay, it's a lot lighter. I didn't realize it was that dark. I'm just gonna take this sleek makeup in the color henna to warm it up. Okay, so I think this matches my skin a little bit better. I've not worn foundation or any makeup since I came back from a holiday, which was a week ago, or nearly a week ago, so I've not tested out any foundation, so. We're just gonna go with this right now. Let's just pretend that it matches my skin, okay? Cool, thanks. So that foundation I'm gonna actually use as a concealer. Beyonce's makeup was pretty simple. I think, like the rest of the makeup. You know, it's not much contouring and you know, that stuff. So I'm just gonna go under my eyes and I see just saw um, down the center of my face. So this is NC45 by the way. Blend it out. It might take a little bit away of your 
eyeliner, but you know, it's fine. Just gonna neaten up the other, other corner a little bit. Oh, she doesn't have much contouring, like I said, so I'm just gonna take the rest of that concealer color I just used, put it around here, just under all of my cheeks. So now I'm taking a little, tiny little bit of my banana powder and putting it under my, oh, and putting it under my eyes because, you know, wrinkles, grease. Like, I'm not gonna bake, just gonna lightly dust it over. Pressing it on with my beauty blender. And with the leftover, I'm just gonna go down the center of my face and a little bit, a little bit under the hollows of my cheeks. Also in the picture, it didn't look like she was wearing any blush. But I could see Sir John, he was like putting on some blush, um, sorry, some highlight stick on. But I don't have that stick, so I'm just gonna use the, I'm uh, putting the MUA highlight in opalescent amber. My fan brush, get the highlight in. Ooh, highlight. This is also the same highlight I used over the, my holiday because like it was like, you know, it was a like bronze it's going on the center of my face. Top lip, maybe a little bit under the brows. Going back in with that uh, black eyeliner just to make it a bit darker again because it rubbed a little bit off when I put the concealer on. So for the lips, I'm going to go in with my MAC lip liner, which is in current, and just line it and then fill it in as well. So when it comes to Beyonce's Cupid's bow, well, she just goes over it like a straight line, which is what I just did. So now I'm gonna go in with my really old MAC lipstick in Hang Up. I think they still have it in stock. So I'm just gonna go in with the lip brush, just to get the edge. So this lipstick is a cream sheen, which means you don't need to put a gloss over it. Cool, so let's set it with some spray. There we go. And that's the Beyonce look. But um, yeah, so it was just like testing it out and everything. You know, I've not done it. I've not, you know, practiced beforehand. I kind of just looked at my palettes and, you know, just wanted to recreate this look. My sister actually sent me the photo. She's like, oh my God, look how beautiful. And I was like, oh my God, I gotta do a video. <laughs> oh, there's Beyonce. So the t-shirt we got at the concert. Yeah, I hope you like this look. I hope you guys enjoy the little chit chat we had, you know, my sister in the background. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like this video. Thumbs up or subscribe, you know, if you want to keep up with me. Check out my social media down below, which is Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter. Um, I Snapchat a lot more than anything else. Um, you can follow my lifestyle stuff on Instagram as well. Uh, you can also check out my sister's channel and social media. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Bye. Yay.